Hello and welcome to Logan and, and Corey show. show. We're not Corey, but whatever. This is like a radio show, and we are going to interview Power Stars Three Two One. What's up? And that's him right there on the other line. Yes. Hello, my fans and subscribers. And be sure to look at my other stuff besides the don't push the B button. Those are getting way too much attention. Yeah, tell me about it. Yeah, yeah, yeah I have to agree with that. You know, I think that I'm... Be a little bit cool. I think that, you know, the, um, don't press the B buttons are very unique in own way. Yet they, a lot of people have the don't press the B button for Pokemon and... Yeah, I really like some more attention on the Mario blooper stuff. Did somebody say Mario? Yes, I said Mario. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, there's actually a version of that song with, with lyrics to it. I just searched for Dr. Mario with lyrics. Oh, uh, yes, we will. I, I highly suggest listening to it. All right, so we're going to start with the questions. All right. First question is, what do you think about your success of 22,000 views total? I, I'm very... I really enjoy that because I'm just I'm just making some movies in uh, Microsoft Paint and Windows Movie Maker. They sometimes they have lots of effort put into them, but most of the time I'm just I'm just throwing something together for pure entertainment. You know, but I feel, you know, uh, do you ever stop to consider what people think of your videos? Well, uh, I've only seen t two people leave hateful comments. For instance. A, uh, a kid named uh, Young Sora 12 left a comment on my video, Mario Bloopers 12, saying it was horrible, and I asked him why. He did not reply. Yeah. And um, on my Don't Push the B button, there's this guy called Club Penguin Fan. He keeps insulting. Well, he's probably really mad because he pressed the B button. <laughs> he probably pushed the B button while playing Pokemon, and his Pikachu got mutated into... Something. Chewbacca. <laughs> probably. Uh, probably, che probably some weird combination of Chewbacca and Dr. Mario. Well, why not Dr. Phil, too? <laughs> <laughs> oh, it also has a little bit of Sonic in there. You yeah. can tell because it's blue. Yeah. I, I can imagine, you know, that the Don't Press the Beeple on, you know, trilogy has almost over 95% of your total success on YouTube. What do you think about that, Johnny? I've been thinking about making a fourth one. Maybe with some of the new Pokemon. And I also think that if you do that, you might get 1,000 views like your previous one. Yep, and I, and I might also have to, to add a note that, saying, please watch my other stuff too. Maybe you should add a note saying, please watch the Corgan show. Yes, I will also I will also have to add that. That yeah. that way we can both get a lot more attention. Yeah, it's hard getting attention. I'm surprised that our Super Bowl ones got the attention they did. But do you think you'll ever get one million views? It'll pro probably take a few years, but hang on a second. Yes. <laughs> And, huh. You don't think I'm going to kill them? And we're going to have to play music or something. Johnny? Yes? Okay, you're there. We just had a little music break. But. Yeah, that sounds good. Alright, I got a question for you again. Yes? If you're in a situation, would you ever push the B button? Um, it, if, I, if I was in an epic battle against the world's most powerful Pokemon, then, I'm, then I would probably have to. Hmm. 
what do you think, you know, Power Stars is going at this point? What do you think, you know, Power Star C21 is going to end up within, like, maybe, I would say, oh, de December of 2011? Yeah, I, th I think they don't push the B buttons. Those are going to have maybe 20,000 views because they've gotten, like, 10, because the first one's got, like, 10,000 something now. And um, speaking of uh, don't push the B button, in Pokemon games, do you know what? When you actually push the B button when a Pokemon's evolving... Does it stop it? Instead of mutating the Pokemon, it actually just makes them stay in their current state instead of evolving. Yeah, that's why the first time I saw that, I was kind of cracking up. Because I think I yeah, did I, that once. I, I just came across it one day. They were looking at Pokemon, and I was like... <laughs> And then I eventually just wanted to make my own. So, there you have it, folks. Interview with Johnny, the co-creator of Power Stars 321. Or 321, however you want to. Yes. And um, but before I go, there's, there's something that, the viewers, that I think the viewers will enjoy. What will he enjoy? Have Instead of having just that Dr. Mario background music, search for Dr. Mario's lyrics, and then we'll and then we'll end up with something very awesome to give the viewers. Yeah, I think I'll add a link in the description. Yeah, j yeah. So when you're done making this, you can just look that up and add a link. Yeah. So so people watching this video, just look down in the description. Yeah, that guy already has a bunch of attention, but I think it's only fair to give him some more. Yeah, I guess so. Yeah, because he is very talented. So, Johnny, what do you think, what other people think about your about your videos? What do you think they think? I mean, besides, it's bad that they watch them a lot. What do you think they actually think? Because they may well, or may I not like them. I have, like, 13 to 14 subscribers at the moment, but um, there are some uh, bad comments. There are some comments on my videos that are just like, Hey, this video is awful. And they usually, they usually have poor grammar or don't explain why they don't like it. Yeah, that's a, that's what I bet pe YouTube people do when they don't like stuff. And, this. and, the, and these people are known simply as trolls. <laughs> and the gone through a troll under the bridge. I'm guessing, I'm guessing they live under the bridge of YouTube. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> They're in the river of bad comments heading into the... By the, by the grassy fields of no, by the grassy fields of no life. <laughs> yeah, but you know, yeah, I just you know I know that a lot of people may I know a lot of people watch some videos, but yet they don't really like them. Yeah, they just they like they have they watch a few videos by usually they don't like them. They just continue to watch the videos. But that's not really helping them in any way. In fact, it's making the user they don't like more popular. Yeah. Giving them more views and more comments. It seems like you know, once you're first starting out, and you're, well, let's say, less than a thousand views on one video or something, right? And you're saying, it's, it's hard, it's hard, because people, when people look at, your, look at your video and they don't see more than a thousand views, they think it's a bad video, even though it may be a very good video, it's just, yeah, it's just like, starting out. It could be this really talented guy doing, doing something awesome, like for instance, the, the, this vi these videos are, are actually popular, but just using it as an example, they could have this video of foreign, com of hilarious foreign commercials. For instance, they they have this one of uh, of it's a commercial for cheese, but it's really weird. They have a panda, and if you don't eat the cheese, then then the panda does something horrible. For instance, in one, he goes to the hospital, and he she pushes over the TV and cut off and cut off cuts off the patient's air supply. <laughs> wow, that panda must yeah, be really ticked and, off. And, and at the end of the commercial, it has text on the screen. Never say no to Panda. Because huh. if you do, you're going to get hurt. Kung Fu Panda. Now on YouTube. Kung, Kung Fu Panda. Now he makes cheese. Wow. This is a cheesy video. <laughs> <laughs> I see where you're coming from. Yes, yeah, so... Thank, thank you for being on our interview today, Johnny. I really appreciate it. Oh, it was a pleasure.
And now we're going to have a music segment right now. Now we hope you enjoyed the show. Say goodbye, Johnny. Bye. And be sure to actually watch the Mario bloopers. Those are the ones I put the most effort into. Yeah, 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 Power Stars. Goodbye. And we hopefully will have you on one of our videos of our show. Yes, that would be awesome. I made a video with Logan, actually. Um, that's not posted yet, but it will be eventually. Yes, well, I hope to see you soon. Yeah. To have a proper interview or whatever. We work on the second episode of that. Yeah, and I have an idea for you to do. Come up with ideas that you could do to contribute to our show, the Corrigan Show. That would be good. Like, maybe I can make, like, a small appearance in one episode. Okay. Yeah, kind of like uh, in Family Guy when Cleveland wasn't in the whole show, and then they had a vote. But speaking of that, I have a joke that you that you may recognize, and uh, play along if you do recognize it. Hmm, I'm reading the newspaper. Huh. Funny. It's not in there. I thought it would be big news. <laughs> Alright, so, so the pig says to the horse, why the long face? <laughs> what does the horse say back? You're a pig. <laughs> <laughs> yes, but you know, so I have to go home. So, so we got like 20 seconds because we're going to end at 12 seconds. So, you got 15 seconds to say whatever. Alright. Blah, blah, blah. So watch, so come on people, watch the local no, no Corey show. Okay, watch our videos and watch Power Star 321. And have a great day.